Hey, what is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today I just did my kind of everyday makeup routine. Um, yeah, this is what I wear normal day-to-day -day basis. It's nothing fancy. It's nothing hard at all. It's very, very simple. But I thought I'd show you because, I don't know, I thought it would be interesting to see how, because a lot of you guys see me and you see me do these extravagant looks. I don't wear those on an everyday basis. Sadly, I wish I did. I don't have enough time to do that. Um, a real full out glam look takes me about an hour to do. I am not getting up an hour earlier just to do my makeup for school. So this look takes me about 10, 15 minutes the most max if I'm going a little more extravagant with my face or my eyes. But this is my very, very simple, simple look so i hope you guys like it and if you want to see how i got it go ahead and keep on watching so normally i would start off with primer but because i'm doing just my everyday makeup look i usually don't wear primer just because it's very minimal makeup i would say um i would just normally i just moisturize with my aloe vera gel which i already did off camera so that's it <laughs> Now I'm going to go into my eyebrows. I usually just use a clear brow gel or sometimes I will use a tinted brow gel. So I'm just combing my hairs upwards, kind of just following the, the natural shape of my eyebrow. Now I go in with the concealer, which today I'm using the Tarte Shape Tape Matte Foundation. So I use this as a concealer rather than a foundation just because it is way too light for me. And it actually works pretty well. It has a similar formula as the Tarte Shape Tape. So right here I'm just going in to any spots that I need to Kind of just correct that's pretty much it and I use my sponge under my eyes only and I just use whatever's left to do my eyelids So when I usually do this, I this everyday type of makeup, I usually wear it to school um, if I'm just going to be out for a little bit. I normally don't do full face every day. There are times where I will go to school with the full face, like on Fridays or something, you know, or if I have an event, pictures or something like that. So what I do with the rest of my face is I use my finger. So my fingers are a lot warmer than the sponge, so I just, it kind of just melts the product into my face rather than lifting it. Because with the sponge, it can take out some of the product. I'm just gonna use a sponge up here, just cause I did apply it now I'm just gonna go over my face just with the sponge now I'm gonna take a brush from my nose really quickly because I do have a pimple on my nose just and when I do have pimples that are more prominent I will go in with this um, wet n wild concealer brush just to kind of minimize the pimple. <sighs> now I'm gonna go in with some loose powder. So this is the uh, Cody Airspun Loose Face Powder in Translucent. <clears throat> and I'm just using just a little bit of this with my brush. And I'm just going in the areas that I used the concealer, so practically all over my face. <clears throat> my chin. Okay. 
<clears throat> now I'm just gonna go in with some blush. So for my everyday kind of look, you wanna say, I always wear blush, like, I just do, I don't know why. Blush is a key essential look to me, because if you have like a white face, it doesn't look very attractive or appealing. So I really love blush, like, when I was a little bit younger, I wouldn't wear blush all the time because I didn't like blush, which is so weird. I would only just wear like bronzer and contour and then highlight. I would never wear blush. But now, I'm obsessed with blush and I never leave the house without blush. Like, I could literally just put on blush. There's times where I do leave the house with no makeup at all and I'll just throw on some blush and curl my eyelashes and we're good to go. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> but yes, oh, I didn't even mention the blush I was using. This is the Drop of a Hat Super Shock Cheek by ColourPop. So this is what the one, this is the blush I use. Um, now I go into a little bit of highlight. So I'm just using my um, Fenty Beauty highlighter in Hustle Baby. So I just apply a little bit, I don't, Put a lot, just a little bit, just to add to a tiny bit of sheen to my face. And now I'm just gonna spray my face with my Maybelline Lasting Fix Plus, Fix Plus, Fixing Spray. <laughs> just let that soak in. Now I will do this depending on how much time I have. If I'm running late, I won't do this step, but if I do have a little bit more time, I will go ahead and go in with this step. So I'm just taking a palette. This is the Toasted Tartlet Palette by Tarte. And I'm just going to take this shade and a little bit of this shade right here. So I'm using the shade Latte and the shade Cashmere. And I just take those two on my, on a fluffy brush and I kind of just pop that into the lid just to add some color and dimension to the lids just so it's not a blank canvas. Excuse me, I burped. <laughs> just so you're not, you don't have such a blank canvas on your eyes. So like I said, I do this step depending on how much time I have or if I really need it. <clears throat> now I like to go in just with my eyelash curler and a little bit of mascara. There are days where I don't even put mascara on, I would just curl my lashes, but today I am going to <clears throat> do mascara. are like straight down and they don't curl at all so I have to like curl my eyelashes a lot to get them to really stick up and be cute my eyelashes are decently long they're not super super long but they are kind of on the shorter side they are just very very straight and just go straight down so So after I do that step, I just pop on some Carmex, some chapstick, whatever I have. And that's pretty much it for my makeup routine. This is what I wear to school, to church, to um, anywhere if I'm just going out real quickly when I'm not doing a full beat. This is my makeup look. I really think it's super simple, it's nothing too hard. And I really only do it in 10 minutes. So. Um, sometimes if I go a little bit more with the eyeshadow or a little bit more with the found, um, if I do decide to put, um, foundation or anything, 
or primer it does take about 15 minutes the most so yeah um yeah this is pretty much it i hope you guys liked it and if you did go ahead and um give it a thumbs up like and comment and subscribe if you're not already i love you guys have a blessed day